What's good, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of The Producer's Life. I am your man, Big Boy Tracks, as always. And today, we're about to be cooking up a 70 Soul sample from scratch. We're going to do it in the lane of my man, Barry White, the music maestro, legendary, iconic music producer, composer. I definitely want to make sure it has that 70 Soul vibe above anything, even if it doesn't really nail you know, the Barry White sound. I want to make sure that I definitely have that 70 Soul vibe to it. So I want you guys to sit back and relax. and hope you guys enjoyed this beatmaker video. Let's go. To start this off, I got a nice drum break loaded up on the screen. Now this drum break actually came from one of my homeboys by the name of Lucius. He's been drumming for about, I want to say like 20 plus years. And I hit him up and let him know I want to do like a Barry White sounding sample, but I wanted some very convincing sounding drums. And this is what you see right here on the screen. I end up chopping it up to, you know, my liking. So as you can hear, the nice snare, the nice kicks, the uh, hi-hats and stuff like that to really give it that Barry White, you know, 70s vibe. Also, you see I got Addictive Keys put up, and this is the Studio Grand, and this is called Intense Keys. I'm going to keep this one very simple, and I'm going to come up with a basic chord progression and um, just something that kind of fits in that, that Barry White vibe, that Love Unlimited type of sound that, you know, he used to create. All right, guys, so next let's throw in a bass line. And for the bass line, we're gonna be using Trillium. You see, I got it put it up, and this preset is the RB mute. What I like about this one, honestly, is it sounds nice and it does not cause any type of RAM issues. So we're gonna follow along with the melody and let's get this thing going, guys. sound dope so I got my good so I got my electric guitar already hooked up and I'm about to go ahead and plug it into the guitar pedal so we can get a little wah wah sound going on really give it that official 70s soul sound so let's head over there Now it's time to add in some strings. And for the strings, as always, we will be using East West Hollywood strings. If anybody were to ask me like what strings that I would get, you know, if I want to do soul samples or just in general, I would definitely say East West Hollywood strings. Some of the best strings out there. There are a lot of other options out there, but these are one of my favorites. But anyway, let's go ahead and lay this down. We're going to follow this melody and let's keep this thing going. That is soulful. Oh my God, man. That string in combination with that guitar adds like that funky soul element to it. Now let's go ahead and add in another set of strings and this set of strings are gonna be the background strings. It's gonna be an ensemble of strings and for the ensemble of strings, I will be using Hollyon. And funny enough, the preset is called the Hard Ensemble. Now I could have used uh, East West Hollywood strings once again, but Hollyon does have some pretty nice sounding strings in there. Not in comparison with, you know, East West Hollywood strings, but they do a pretty good job of having some decent sounding strings in here. I gotta say that.
Yeah, that's... Woo! Continue to add that kind of funky soul type of sound. We definitely want to add in the clavinet. Now this is a sound that Barry White utilized often in a lot of his records. So as you see on the screen right here, I got the Touch of Wild clavinet pulled up, and this is out of Halion. And a record off top, um, Stevie Wonder, very superstitious. Go listen to that record and you'll hear this in there. But anyway, let's go ahead and lay this down and uh, keep this thing moving. For the final sound to wrap this thing up, we're gonna be using an electric piano. As you see right here, I got the Mark I crystals pulled up. And we're gonna be using that sustain pedal once again. I think I did it in my last video. I love using the sustain pedal to really add that dreamy effect to it. But anyway, let's go ahead and lay this down to keep this thing going. <laughs> Fire. All right, so we're at that point in time where it's time to get this track arranged. So far, this sample sounds absolutely incredible. Like, it sounds amazing. But with that said, let's hop back into this track so you guys can check out what this finished product is going to sound like. Let's go. All right guys, so that wraps up this beat making video. I do hope you guys enjoyed that. Overall, this sample came out super crazy. As you guys can tell, I added that little piano roll in there at the beginning. That's like one of Barry White's signature things to do at the beginning of a lot of his records. So I definitely had to add that in there. Shouts out to my boy Lucius for the drum break. It definitely has that 70 funky soul sound to it. And overall, it sounds amazing. But you guys let me know what you think down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this beat making video, go ahead and give it a like, give it a thumbs up and do all that good stuff. And if you haven't subscribed, please make sure you do because I will be coming back again this weekend with another beat making video. I want to thank everybody for watching and kicking it with your man Big Boy Tracks right here at the Producer's Life. And I'll see y'all next time. Peace.